All right, good morning, everybody, um, or good day, whatever you're watching this video. Uh, D plus heading into work. Um, thought I'd do something a little bit different and start uh, having some conversations with the camera, I guess, conversations with myself um, about different things. And the first thing uh, that kind of came to mind is something that's been on my mind for a little while is um, everybody. A lot of people are going through a deconstruction period of their faith, and I think that most uh, believers have to go through some store, some sort of deconstruction, reconstruction, um, and it feels like it's like a real hot button topic. But I feel like this type of stuff has always been going on. We just kind of put a pretty title on it. Um, I know for myself, I went through this when I went off to college back in 2002 is when it started, I would say. And I don't think things got really wrapped up until maybe 2008-ish, 2009, 2010, somewhere in there. Um, is when things got, got kind of buttoned up for me. So, and I don't even really like called it deconstruction just because at first, um, it happens with every term. At first, a, a term is has a real meaning to it, but then other people grab a hold of it and ruin it. Um, that happens a whole lot, uh, quite frankly, within the black culture. Um, something that we use is cool and means a certain thing, and then other people come and take it, and now the meaning is, is now the term is pretty much meaningless. So uh, that was a complete rabbit trail. Um, I tend to do that from time to time. But back to what I was saying. So I tend to not like to call it deconstruction. Um, I tend to not want to call it reconstruction. I call it a renovation. Um, and I know that's just another term that somebody can take and um, that they can take and do whatever they want with it. But the reason why I call it a renovation, um, and I'll probably get into it as I tell my story, is that um, I watch a whole lot of HGTV with my wife. Um, we used to watch a whole lot more. We don't watch as much, but we still do watch quite a bit of HGTV and um, a number of shows. Uh, what's Chip and Joanna's show? Fixer Upper, Flipper Flop, um, Good Bones. It's a whole bunch of them. And one of, one of the things that what happens during a renovation, they bring in like the experts and they have, they have all these ideas of what they want to do. But then they have to bring in like these experts to figure out like what they can actually do. Like you can't knock out this wall because it's low bearing or you can't do or you have to do this because they use oil based paint and they got to get that off. Or the structure maybe have a crack in it. So they got to do some other things, lift up the house, fix the fix the, the slab or whatever, whatever it may be. So those are like renovations where they tear something down to like the bones of something and then um, essentially put it back together with some of the same material, um, sometimes without some of the same material. Uh, they reinforce some things, they take some things completely out and say this is trash. So um, so that's what I try to look at um, this journey for me. Like I said, it started 2002 um, and then um, ended like somewhere close to 2010. Um, so that's what it's been for me. It hasn't been like this completely deconstructing. Because deconstructing can sound a little violent. It can sound like, um, like you like destroy. They don't mean the same thing, but deconstruct, destroy. People just kind of link that together, and people feel like they're tearing their face apart. Um, I didn't look at it that way. Um, I looked at it as um, things need to be renovated. Some of the things that um, that I put on were not um, were not helpful. They were just traditions passed down, sometimes meaningful traditions, sometimes um, just traditions just to control people. But they need to be uh, they need to be torn down and they need to be renovated nonetheless. So that's what I want to do um, in these short talks um, on the way to work. My idea I don't want to talk too much while I'm on the on the interstate on the highway, but I have like this 10 minute strip while I'm driving into work. Um, where I'm not on the highway and um, and all that good stuff. So that's what I got. Um, I'm trying to keep these videos around, right around five minutes. Um, don't want them to be too long. So this is my first five minute installment. I'm about to hop on the highway and get on into work. Um, and um, I will holler at y'all later. Peace in, confusion out, and be positive.